Only two teams now in the running to lift the EA Cup. Who will be victorious in the final? This is Derek Ray, joined as always in the commentary box by Stuart Robson. It's Real Madrid facing Manchester City. Well, it's been a long journey for both these teams, Derek. It's not been easy, but these players are 90 minutes away from making history for themselves. No doubt both managers will have set out their game plans and made sure every player knows exactly what their roles are. What a game we have in store for us. And here's the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is the keeper of choice. Antonio Rudiger plays alongside Eder Militao in central defence. Rodrigo plays with Vinicius Jr. in the wide areas. And the main threat in attack today should be Kylian Mbappe. And so the starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson stands between the posts. John Stones plays alongside Ruben Dias in central defence. Kevin De Bruyne plays with Rodri in central midfield. And providing the main goal-scoring threat today is Erling Haaland. Real using width to good effect. A disappointing end to the move. Haaland. Well, not smooth, but fiercely competitive in midfield. Missing the target by a tiny margin. Well, it's a difficult skill to get right, but he almost pulled it off there. He made such good contact with the ball. Jude Bellingham. But I'll tell you what, I really admire the fact that Jude Bellingham can do just about everything. He can score, he can set up chances, he can defend. What do you expect to see from him in this game? Well, he's the creative spark for this team. He can drift past defenders, he can pick a pass, and he's got that pace off the mark. And I'm sure we're going to see that again today. Could cross it in here. Closing down well. The fans are shouting, shoot. Can they stop it going in? Carvajal. Foiling his opponent completely. Well, you sense it's just a matter of time before Real score here. They're certainly piling on the pressure. They could easily be ahead now. And an astute piece of defending. De Bruyne. Holland. Valverde. Well, Real Madrid have certainly had all the possession over the last 15 minutes and have played some really lovely football going forward. They must now make it count and get themselves in front. Yes, it's going to plan and they might be able to carve out another chance. Could be troublesome. Not a foul, but the advantage with Real Madrid. Rodri. On to Silva. Jack Grealish. Looking for that final pass. Looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Well, the referee remaining very much in control. Now the...
Federico Valverde. And a significant block following that cross. Sloppy there, Bernardo Silva. Mbappe. And the flag has gone up here, offside the decision. Bernardo Silva. They're not looking after the ball in the usual manner, City. Mbappe. A very timely interception. Real might threaten on the flank. Valverde. And he couldn't quite get himself back on side, Stuart. Well, as a player, you need to be able to change your mind. But he wasn't able to, and that's a poor pass. Foden. That's a good ball. Oh, how about that for a tackle? Federico Valverde. And now Rodrigo. Return to Mbappe. Rodrigo. And plays with a positional sense that is second to none. Now far from a smooth challenge. Now will the referee produce a card? And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. De Bruyne. I'm trying to switch the play, but overcut. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. Mbappe. Now with Valverde. Back to Mbappe. Rodrigo. And still they wait for the chance. But it's great when you can rely on your keeper. And that is that half-time here in the Spanish capital. to the second half then here at the Bernabeu Grealish here's Carvajal Valverde and a fine tackle Vinicius Junior. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? Rodri. Phil Foden now. De Bruyne. Foden. Just as well from the defensive point of view that he was able to make that interception. Well, offside, I rather think he was caught in two minds. Well, he just needed to go elsewhere with his pass. He showed a complete lack of awareness there. Stones. And Grealish. Bernardo Silva. Holland. Nicely timed tackle. De Bruyne. Really fine piece of defending play to break us up.
A lot of pressure applied. Can they take advantage? Perfect example of how to put in a tackle. And a corner will be next. And De Bruyne firing it over. Well, the timing was nearly perfect with that header. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Oh, a fine block. Jack Grealish. De Bruyne now. Oh, nice ball. And Real doing well to win it back. Rodri. Well read to ease the pressure. Well, difficult for both sides to find any passing rhythm. De Bruyne. Grealish. And the cross smuggled away. And there's the feed into the box, and it should... The first goal of the game. Well, I can't believe that chance has been squandered. That should have been the opener. Well, what can you say? That is excellent from the goalkeeper. A brilliant save. Mbappe. Mbappe! Oh, that's top-notch goalkeeping, you've got to say. And they've given back possession easily. And Real's creative tendencies coming to the fore. Well, Real Madrid are certainly creating opportunities to take the lead here, but that was a brilliant piece of goalkeeping to keep them at bay. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Just ten minutes to go. Now perhaps they can counter from here. Mbappe. Still level. Real Madrid continue to look for what could be a winner. Another good tackle. Mendy. Chouameni. Here's Valverde. Vinicius Junior. Workout. Watered by the post. Valverde. Must take the lead here. And they do. And with so little time left, that will surely be decisive. Astonishing drama. another look and it's a very good goal and they deserve it you have to say they've been excellent well a dramatic moment near the end and that might well be the decider
chasing this game, Manchester City, with time running out. Oh, a vital interception. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. Aurelien Chouameni. Here's Cavaral. And so there we have it, the final whistle, and Manchester City have lost this game. What did you make of it? Well, I thought it was a really intense game. Lots of quality, lots of good individual displays. In the end, though, they won't be happy with the defeat, nor the manner of it, conceding so late on. And now for the moment of confirmation, the trophy presentation. Well, this is what they were dreaming of before the game. To come and pick this trophy up. What a performance from them. Yes, a performance that has impressed absolutely everyone. And now it comes down to holding that piece of silverware aloft. The sweet taste of success. It has been quite the journey. And it comes to an end in style on the big stage. And now the celebrations can begin. Not just the players, but also the fans, the coaching staff. What a performance it's been.